What? Hey, look, y'all. So Z is first thing. Let, let me talk about Z is real quick. I want to ask y'all a serious question, real quick, bro. All right, I see it's not lagging now. I can see when it's lagging and when it's not. So I just one v one flight reacts. The one v ones was successful, even though flight was trying to collab and do do motherfucking. This nigga Flight was trying to do reaction video collabs. Flight, our, bro, that was tough for you. Of course I wasn't going to do that, my nigga. No hard feelings, but after the 1v1s, I had to get a little Hollywood on you. I got you up out the way, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? But, hey, you still my guy. Mad respect for you. You secured the back. That nigga hit me up talking about he want to react to some videos. I don't even want to do reactions no more, bro. But look, y'all. I want to give a big shout out to Flight Reacts, man. I have so much respect for Flight. Um, little do y'all know, outside of like the L's that he take, the dude actually secure his bag. He'll go all the way out, man, to make sure he got some videos for y'all. And me and Flight actually had like a good ass conversation, man. And he was he gave me some wise words and went. Like, I take motivation from anybody. Like, the littlest shit motivate me to, like, go crazy. But coming from Flight React, somebody that I actually talk about all the time, even though it's jokes and entertainment, if I see them in person and shit, it's all love. But Flight Reacts told me, like, bro, we could take over this IRL shit right now. We could take over IRLs, pranks. Basically, nigga, I could do anything I want to do. He says, basically, on me. You know what I'm saying? And I know a lot of YouTubers see this, man. Y'all got y'all see all these big ass YouTubers and these niggas who just be talking down on me. But I never respond. I never like. I let y'all do the talking. Like they be arguing with y'all. But these niggas is really fans of me, bro. And I and I'm really starting to notice the more and more and more I grow, the more and more and more powerful, and the more and more. Like, I've been trying to play Christopher London all year. And we know the backstory of as to why we didn't play, but I didn't say nothing in the video because I don't really want no drama. I just want to hoop. You get what I'm saying? But we know what happened when Christopher London with the... We know what happened. What he did, right? I don't want to say nothing because I don't want to start no extra bum-ass drama. But... Man, fuck all. These niggas can't fuck with me. Why am I sitting here explaining myself to these bum-ass niggas? First of all, is. You have nothing to do with basketball, my nigga. At, in any type of way, shape, or form. I tell my subscribers all the time that this shit is not about the money. And y'all come up and create this fake-ass event as this, this event is definitely going to get so Illuminati to come. My nigga, fuck, the, fuck that event, my nigga. If it was about the money, I would have made my last two fucking IRL videos longer than 10 minutes. I didn't care about that shit. It's never about the money with me. And I've been saying that shit since day one. You get what I'm saying? Fuck the event. Z is you have nothing to do with IRL basketball unless you talking about playing. I was going to bet flight against you. You in the same category as flight reacts. You get what I'm saying? What do Z is have to do with any of this hooping shit? Can y'all tell me what he have to do with this? He a promoter? Oh, so he was trying to promote an event? I'm just trying to figure out where do he fit in with this IRL shit. I mean, obviously, he's trying to get the bag. I, I respect it if he's trying to get money, but, like, people keep hitting me up, talk about Z is said and Z is said and Z is said. Bro, what the fuck I'm going to say to him? The nigga don't hoop. And far as Christopher London go, man, I didn't bring up the drama situation of him acting like he wanted to play me. Remember my man's exposed Christopher London? I ain't bring that shit up. Christopher London in the video said Solomonati, the only reason why we haven't played is because of me. And talk Roses about... Are red. Violets are blue. You disrespected in the Illuminati. Now I'm coming after you. Since you disrespected my name multiple times, when I see you out in public, you're going to catch 50 Hall of Fame spears, 35 Hall of Fame recos, and 20 super kicks. You can't get near me, my nigga. Trust me. But listen. 
Your name is Indian Illuminati. That's tough. You Indian? That's tough. I like my Native Americans. But listen. So Christopher London, in his little video, he comes out of nowhere. These niggas comes out of nowhere when they see me doing my thing, but I don't really brag about it. I don't really throw it in everybody's face. You know, like I said, I was down, but I'm up now. Now these big YouTubers hit me up now. Y'all didn't hit me up at all before. I've been trying to play everybody. Y'all was the one. Y'all remember we was just, we was just sit back, relaxing, and just reacting to everybody videos and shit. Now we actually doing the IRLs and shit that we used to react to. And now motherfuckers want to hit me up. But when I was on the sideline looking in, begging to play Christopher London, begging to play everybody, I got blocked on Twitter. The nigga blocked me. He faked like he wanted to play me. My man's exposed the messages. Talk about, oh, I'm, I, I don't really want to play him. And, like, there's so much shit that people don't really know about. Because I don't really say much. But, man. I play Christopher London anytime, any day after New Year's, man. It's a new year. But he got to come to me. I'm not changing my rules for no nigga. I don't give a fuck how many subscribers you got. You have to come and play me. Simple. Y'all get what I'm saying? Hey, send me some heat, though. Send me some heat. Send me some videos to react to. And by the way, I'm just trying to drop videos. I don't want to have no drama, no beef with none of these YouTubers, that old shit we used to do, because that shit really don't do nothing for me at all. Because at the end of the day, all y'all want to see is some bangers, bro.